Coding overload. Oh. Hey, how you doing? Hang on one sec. Need to jot something down real quick. Okie doke. Anyway, it's monkey game. Welcome to monkey. Amazing mini They're putting chemicals in the water. I like the high quality <laughs> version of that. All right, checking, checking, testing, <laughs> testing. This might be good. Oh no. Oh no.
Monkey. Monkey game. No, no, no. Give me the red one. Yeah. They're forty dollars. Oh man. Hey. I mean, that's pretty expensive, but they do say Mamma Mia, so. I guess there is that. Okay. So does it just put me in a level or do I have to select the level? No, I think it just puts me in. Yeah, it just puts me in a level. Here we go. So, if you remember Donkey Kong 94, this is basically that, except more. Okay, I want the key. I need it to open the door. Need to kill shy guy toy. We couldn't afford real shy guys. We had to recreate them with animatronics. I would call him Mini Me. Good, got the star. I like having stars. So you could just, uh... You could just do this in like any order, I guess. But I'll do them, I'll do them in chronological order. The order that the game has decided for me. Here we go. Ooh, music. Oh, no, wait, I need the red back. Oh, no. No. Can I just walk past that? Yeah, I can. Okay. I'm overcomplicating things. Okay. I mean, it's not going to be too complicated right off the bat. Uh, hang on one sec. First, let me make sure that's... I don't really notice a difference when I do. Okay. See, this game is good because it allows you to see a realistic trash can in the Mario universe. Which is all I look for in a game, really. Okay. I thought I could reuse that. 
re I thought I could recycle. Okay, now we're going to Trash World. Which is where I live in real life. Here we go. Yeah, see, this is this is how you know it's a Mario, I mean a Donkey Kong 94 sequel. Because you do this! Oh yeah, Dick Tracy. Physics in this game scare me a little bit. Like Mario, you like you release the analog stick, and Mario goes forward like a little bit, but not too much. So that'll take some getting used to. Okay, so I want to use this to get across here. Yeah, very, very simple puzzle so far. Now, I should say, I played Donkey Kong 94 before I streamed it, but this I haven't ever beaten before, so after a point, it's going to be totally blind. Dr. Pepper product placement. Also, I am sick right now, <laughs> if you couldn't tell. Yep, I keep- I keep getting sick, and frankly, I'm getting a little tired of it. It's the Quika. Sparky. I oh, yeah, don't. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh. Actually, I didn't know that, so maybe I should have been reading these. Maybe I actually should have been reading these out. It's kind of funny, like, I wonder how long we're gonna keep getting residual Charles Martinet. Because, because this is definitely not Kevin. Oh, what does that mean? What, what does that mean? Oh, it's the bonus. Yeah, from what I under from what I understand, these are entirely new. Like these did not exist in the original. And they're probably better this way because from what I've seen of the original mini games, they weren't they weren't super compelling. No 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 mamba.
Honestly, one thing that's kind of like worse because it's better is that the original game was just full of like general MIDI sounds and like <laughs> and like royalty free sound effects. And it's weird to like not hear them. I mean, I gotta say, it's pretty polished. Like, it, it feels like the original game. Though, I do know they made a couple of controversial changes to this. Such as the fact that Mario no longer gets violently immolated in front of the children. Shigeru Miyamoto strikes again, baby. Kids, kids can't even get traumatized in this country anymore. At least not by media. Maybe they just decided there's enough trauma happening in real life. We didn't need it. We didn't need it in a Mario game. Here we go. Yeah, see, like that I knew. I mean, you've seen me use it. Yeah, Mario gets the big jump. Just like in DK94, DK90 before it. Okay. Uh, why do I keep doing that? The brick man is vibrating my controller, like, constantly, so I, I, I'm glad we're continuing the Mario Wonder tradition. The Wonder tradition of just vibrating forever. Yes. My head. My head will not accept brick. But my feet will. Suck brick, kid. Why hasn't this classic enemy come back? Yeah, see that I know all about. I just I just didn't know about this. Okay, now. Now is when things get spicy. And by spicy, I mean very slightly more complicated, but not really all that much. Because yes, now we gotta play the mini Mario level. New mini Mario toys! They say, Mama Flipper! And then you get the song. Oh, but they cannot climb that, so I must make them a path. You know, this level is kind of cool. What if we made a whole bunch of games based on this one level? And what if we just saturated the market with them? Just, just like, constantly release them. I think that would be a good, a good strategy for make a lot of money.
Now we must fight Dong! Must hit Dong with trash can. He does not like to be hit with trash can. Oh no! I mean, I I I feel him honestly. I I tend not to like to be hit with trash can either. Yeah, and I know they replaced the old Grant Kirkhope DK voice with the new one where he goes <laughs> So he doesn't go okay Yep, so we we did all the stuff Mario does a cool pose that that would be easy to crop out for a thumbnail. So thank you for that Hello Zeege Donkey Kong Jungle. Ah, so it's DK's home oh, turf. Stop. Come back. The monkey home field. He has the advantage here. So like I said, again, sorry, I'm I'm sick right now. Got- got me sick again. Falling down a rabbit hole of mechanical keyboards I can't <laughs> afford. Yeah, I- I have a mechanical keyboard I got for about a hundred bucks, I think. It might have been a little less than that. But honestly, I feel like I might have gotten it too clicky. Because I- I failed to account for the fact that I am a streamer. And that having a very clicky keyboard is actually a little bit of a problem. Bum ba da ba da ba 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 da da. Oh, it's jazzy. Oh, uh oh. Mechanical piranha plant. AI is coming for all of our jobs. Oh, <laughs> why, did, why did I do that? Luckily, there's a one up here. They... They knew what I would do. No, okay, you can't make that. That's a ja that's a Jazzio reference. Yeah, I believe he's playing this game right now, too. Probably not sick. Yeah, the two-handed climb. So if you've ever played DK94, or Donkey Kong Jr., or Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy's Conquest, then you know what this is all about. Like I said, it, it's basically DK-94-2. That's not to say DK-409- or 942. That's not what I'm saying. I think that type of climbing would be really difficult in real life. You know, I- you're probably right, but I've also never tried, so I- I feel like I am unqualified to comment on this matter. Oh, you can get on the pole. Mario can shake what his Mamma Mia gave him. Oh, no, wait, I gotta... Oh, we got a lot of Kuika in this song. Oh, look at him. I, I, I like him. He is a good lad. It's This is Rambi's son. New downloads detected. I, I, uh, okay. Yep. Yep. Uh, 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 
Okay, okay. I'm fine. I'm okay. Despite my fumbling. They don't even- they don't even charge at you. They're just happy to be here. <laughs> Quika's like if somebody made McDonald's cup with straw into an instrument. Yeah, yeah it really is. It's- <laughs> It's funny because it, it always sounds very silly to me. And then we get to, you know, go up against Monkey with the tambourines. Everything... Everything in this game is a toy. Here we go. There are no humans left. There are no organic creatures. The robot uprising has truly occurred. Toy Story 5 plot leak. Buzz and Woody decide that they're tired of being second-rate citizens. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know about that. Buzz and Woody decide that they are going to kill the humans and take over the world. It's a toys world now. Aha, you thought you could egg me? Foolish bird. I like that this implies that Mario would die if an egg hit him in the face. It is- it is only by the good grace of God that Mario is still alive. If it's going fast enough, maybe. Well, I mean, yeah, anything will kill you if it's going fast enough. You could get killed by a cashew if it's going 500 miles per hour. Here we go. Okay, now... Now is when stuff starts happening. Oh, I killed it! Oh, I see, I see what's going on. So you gotta put it on the red, then the yellow, then the blue. Okay. And then you gotta go down real fast, get it real quick. And that's all you gotta do. Okay, so now what? What's going on here? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I need to watch more Mythsters. I always liked it. I always did like them Myth Boys. You could- you could fall in there and just not be able to get out, I'm realizing. Like, right here. Yeah, I just- I like that the rhino just does not care. He does not care about me. Which is, you know, relieving, but also a little offensive. What, what, am I not good enough to charge? Am I not good enough for a stampede? You saying I'm- I'm not as good a man as Mufasa? That wasn't even... That wasn't even, uh, Rhinos. That was, like, Wildebeest. Also, I think I missed a present in this first level. I dare say I may have. Jamie Heineman grew up an hour from where I live. That's pretty neat. Jamie Heineman. Get back here! Get back here! 
No, no, get back here. Yeah, 25 lives. I'm gonna need all of them. Every single one. No, I did get the star. The game was just having a bit of a moment. Sax player really earning his paycheck. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he hasn't had a ton of work since uh, Sonic Adventure. And look, it's the thing from Donkey Kong Jr. <laughs> Donkey Kong Jr. though is not in this game because this is the point where Nintendo was like, no, Donkey Kong Jr. is not a person. He is not real. We... <laughs> Any evidence that you may have seen of a Donkey Kong Jr. is purely fabricated. So I guess you could argue that... <laughs> You could argue that he just became regular DK, I don't know. I don't know, Donkey Kong lore kinda doesn't make any sense. And I feel like anyone who would spend a large portion of their life trying to make it make sense. Well, more power to you, I guess. Donkey Kong Jr. becomes Swanky Kong. Oh, that's the real twist, baby. Swanky is the true heir to the DK throne. Speaking of, they should make Bluster Kong canon, I think. They should make him an official character, because why not? Can you give me one good reason? No, you can't. Name one good reason why Bluster Kong should not exist. I don't know. I don't know, a wise man once said, uh, you know what they say, the more the merrier. And I felt that. So you know what? You know what? Make... Make Bluster Kong cannon. Uh, make Wa Peach cannon. Just why not? Why not? It'll give you more characters to make figures of. If you want to make those stupid little amiibo figures. Yeah, you could do this in uh, Donkey Kong 94, but that time it was a real monkey, so it was kind of animal cruelty. And Mario was kind of a bastard. But now, it is an inanimate object. Well, actually, it's a very animate object. If Nintendo was smart, they would have made Bowsette cannon. Oh, well, I, I mean, yeah, they would have made a ton of money off of that, but I do understand the consequences of that one. I don't know. I think people- people just want a Nintendo character that's just like... ...some kind of nasty lady. That's what- that's what they crave. But I mean, hey, uh... Sega made Eggman's daughter canon. Which is kind of surprising. I mean, she looks like... Ashley from WarioWare with, uh, white hair, and not... Oh, so you go down slower, but you go up faster. I mean, honestly, that, uh, omelette design... ...for, uh... ...for Eggman Jr. Honestly, a pretty good design. What? Where's the switch that lets me get this? But yeah, I always did kind of like that design. Oh. 
Oh, my aching tentacles. Okay, no, I need I need the red. If I want to get the present. If I want to live in the present. Oh, I almost made a stinky. In my pants, specifically. Thank God that didn't happen. Mario, please do not do things that I wouldn't do. Uh, the things I do for gold stars. Oh, uh, Mario, don't, don't triple jump into the fireball, please. I'm begging. I'm pleading with you, Mario. Martinio. I p I plea, I plea to him, but Mario does not listen. <laughs> Mario cares not for my feelings. This game feels like someone at Nintendo said, remember Donkey Kong Jr? Why did we stop making those? <laughs> Yeah, Donkey Kong 94 is a lot like that, too, if you've... Have you ever played that? I don't know how many people have played that. I haven't. Well, yeah, if you... It's basically this. Oh, okay, there we, there we go. One of them got up there. Donkey Kong 94 is basically this, but on the Game Boy. Alright, come on, boys. Get in the box. Get in the box. Get in the box. Get into the heads up display. They they love the box so much they became a box. Oh, monkey monkey angry. Monkey angry. Got to drop fruit on monkey. But he blocks it with his robo toys. Yeah, get get fruited. Bit fruity. Uh oh. This is this is not good news for Martinio. Well, I mean, if you didn't hover right below my fruit range. Man who stands right underneath fruit, wondering why he is hit by fruit. <laughs> Isaac Newton. <laughs> I love how- I love my immune system. It, it's so good and it works so well. I mean, at least it's not Covis this time. I hope. I mean, my sister and mom did a test. They didn't have it. I think if I got COVID twice so so close to each other, I, I don't think I would recover. I think I would have permanent brain damage. Oh, why? Why is this so sinister?
Oh no, wait, that's not good enough. It must go up! Ninji! Ninji, my boy! But yeah, I think this is about as far as I ever played in the original game. I don't think I remember getting to the volcano world. Ah. I love how Mario looks at stuff. Or, or does he? Maybe that was an illusion. Maybe that's something I made up. Oh, but he balances. I don't know. He might just kind of be looking up all the time. I mean, that's that's something that's like been a standard feature of video games for like a million years. But I, I always love it. It just it makes. It makes things feel so much more alive when Link is just like. <laughs> oh, it's the chili pepper phoenix. Uh, what is that? The vortex? Is the phoenix coming out of the vortex? Yes, it is. It's like the thing that was- oh, it's the fire eggs. Now see, a fire egg, yeah, that would get you. That- that would do some damage. Oh. I wonder how Kazooie feels about all this. I do know that they, uh, nerfed the fall stun that you get in this game. Like, in the original game, you would, uh, fall off a high place and Mario would get stunned for an obnoxiously long amount of time. And I think they nerfed that. Like, I think they made it less potent. So, I may very well be playing an easier version of this game. I think Kazooie is glad she doesn't shit fire eggs. Does he know? D sorry, does they know? Oh, sniff it. My other boy. Generally, any enemy that's from Mario 2 is my boy. Dang, what's going on in here? Well, I mean, sniffets, of course, but... Oh, cool noise. Oh! Ah, ah, ah! No, sir, not a fan of that. Also not a fan of fire-breathing sniffet. Donkey Kong, why you coming in here? Bro, action figures are not worth this. I don't need that life. Get a life, I have plenty, thank you. That's pretty funny, we should put that on a t-shirt. Oh, Potaboo. Not my boy, but you know. So apparently all of these levels are like a single model. Well, not every level is one. I mean, every level is its own model, but... You know, it's not constructed out of tiles like you might think. Uh, based on like how... Mario Wonder did it. Yeah, you can just go up here. You can just go up here, it's no problem. 
See, see, I pressed the button because I didn't think I grabbed it. Tweeter is your boy. Yeah, Tweeter's pretty good. It's a bit of a shame that uh, Tweeter hasn't appeared in anything else. I mean, we know we know shy guys, shy guys, and baboms. Shy guys, baboms, and pokies are the big three. I think that. Like, that was the big takeaway from Mario 2, but we still got- we got a couple other- well, and Birdo. Obviously Birdo. But that's more of a boss than an enemy. Honestly, I think it's really funny how they make this game for... This, like, TV event. And then they're... <laughs> and then- And then they- they turn it into a Mario game and they're just like... Yeah, this is- this is just canon to Mario now. Like you guys, you guys aren't gonna be using this anymore, so we're just we're just gonna take it back. This is this is ours now. And it's true, I doubt uh what what was it, like Fuji TV? I doubt they would have gotten a lot more use out of it. So it's probably for the best that they can appear in Mario stuff. Uh oh, uh oh, no, don't. <laughs> that is a very goofy noise you guys make there. Also, I like that the vines are chains. That's that's very good. Okay, where's the last frizzante? Oh, it's down here. It's down here on Ninji. I mean, honestly, it's... It's... I mean, who's making these toys? Are these also Mario's toys? Why are Mario's toys attacking him? Who made these? Is this from the Wario toy company? Wario doesn't have a toy company, he has a video game company. Smithy's new job. Honestly, that would be pretty funny if, if Smithy was still alive and he was just... He's just resigned to making toys at this point. He works at Mario's Toy Factory. No, actually... <laughs> it's a good thing that's a magic key. Or otherwise I might have had a problem. Yes, I know the lava's rising. Da danger, water's rising. It's such a bad sign. Don't worry, I know. I'm I'm on top of it. Literally, I'm on top of it. Oh, damn. Mama mia. oh, she is flat like the pancake. Speaking of uh, she, we also got uh, the Princess Peach game coming out in about a month. Probably gonna stream that too. It looks interesting. A bit of a a bit of a hodgepodge, but interesting. Princess Peach Showtime kind of just looks like somebody said, "Hey Nintendo, what do you want this new Peach game to be?" And they're just like, "Eh, you know what, whatever." And then that's the genre. Eh, you know whatever. I wouldn't be surprised if it turned into, like, Devil May Cry halfway through, at this point. They're really going in with the Mario games lately. It's like they had a wildly successful movie recently or something. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, I'm fine. We gotta chase it.
Where was the door? Uh oh, it's going back up. It is a going a back up. Oh, there's the door. But yeah, I mean, honestly, it, it's smart to have like a bunch of Mario product out on the Switch. Because yeah, the movie is going to get a lot of people interested, I'm sure. Or it already has, you know. Oh, why did I do that? I don't even know why I did that. I mean, either way, whatever whatever leads to Thousand Year Door getting remade, you know? If, if saturating the Switch with Mario because they had a movie is what gets the Thousand Year Door remake, then by God, I like it. I really wish I had some sort of idea when it's coming out, though. Like, I mean, I don't need an exact date. It's just like, are, are we aiming for summer? The holidays? You know, that'd be useful information for me to have. Like, just, like, just give me a ballpark estimate. Spit, spitball it with me, Nintendo. Come on. Here we go. Okay, that was easy. I think a Mario Land 2 remake would be poggers. It would be. That would be... I mean, honestly, though, it's not very long. I think the coolest thing they could do, they probably wouldn't do, but the coolest thing they could do, have, like, a Mario Land 2 pack. Remake, uh... Remake the first and second. And, like, include them together. Heck, maybe you could... Maybe you could, like... Remake Mario Land 2, and then remake Mario Land 1 in the same engine, because everybody's always complaining about Mario Land 1's controls. So make it play like Mario Land 2 instead. I don't know. It's, just, it's a thought. Oh, wait, there's that guy down there. No, wait, no, wait, come, come here, little guy. Come here. Uh-oh. We might have a problem here. What they probably do is remake them in Wonders Engine. Well... I guess what we're talking- it depends on if we're talking about engine as far as, like, Unreal, Unity, that sort of thing, or are we talking about, like, the physics and the gameplay, like, that sort of engine. I mean, I don't know. Admittedly, I tend to call that sort of thing an engine because I'm, like, I've had a lot of time in the fan game space where that's what they would call them. It's probably not totally accurate, but yet, you know. Oh, okay, so the music in this remake is pretty good so far. I like it. The original music was always a little funky. Yeah, the, the physics and framework of what- Oh man. I think- I think I messed up. I think that cost me the gold star. Oh, 
I might have to do it again. This is not a long game. I am an hour in and I'm I think I'm already halfway through. Oh no wait, I got the gold star. So I guess getting hit while you're holding something doesn't count. Oh, oh, here we go. Here's the new world. Oh, right. No, wait, no. I'm almost halfway through. Because I forgot, I forgot about the new world. Are we on our way to a one-stream wonder? No, I think it'll probably be at least two. But maybe not more than two. But yeah, this is an entirely new world here. This was not in the original game. We are witnessing never before seen Mario vs. Donkey Kong content. Here we go. So I guess you want to jump. Yeah, and get carried by that. And then you want to you want to throw it in there and then you want to do this. Yeah, there you go. I was assuming they don't pull a DK-94 and say, oh, by the way, the game is like 10 times longer than you thought. I don't think they do. Oh, hey, donut. Donut block. Arr! What's funny is that in Japan, they're named after an entirely different kind of food. I forgot what, the, what they were, though. I mean, not donuts, I can tell you that much. And that's why they're always super long when they're in the 3D games. Because the food that they're based on is also actually long. I wonder what Japan's relationship is with donuts. Did, did, like, how, how, much, how many donuts you think J Japanese people eat? Because I wouldn't be surprised if that wasn't a popular food over there. I don't know. I don't claim to know. Here we go. What do I look like? The Japan man? Ah, oh, penis music. Okay, so we got a spring. We got the spring thing. Oh, Chikua. Or Chikua. A tube-shaped fish cake. No, wait, can I- can I throw this up on here? Uh, sort of, not really. No, let me- let me climb. Why- why won't- why won't you let me climb? Ah! I hit Shy Guy ass! That, that's not good. Do 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 You are not a clown. You are the entire circus. I don't know why <laughs> that was Edgeworth's accent. I guess you can't do that. Oh, no, wait, I know what to do. I know what to do. I know what to do. Oh, now you gotta go down. Oh, you gotta- you gotta go down, and then you gotta drop it. No way. No way, I've messed up. I have goofed it. Maybe you gotta, like... You might gotta, like, race against the clock. No! <laughs> oh, no. No, why? But I did it. I did it. Now what is going on here? Yep. Yeah. 
What the heck? Because if I jump off here, I'm going to die. Can I, can I grab the rope from here? Okay, I can. Turns out it was, it was actually simpler than I thought. How do I get up there? Oh, again, simpler than I thought. Much simp simper. Can I blow him off the rope? Don't... Don't read that like... Don't read that in a weird way. So yeah, it all revolves around these, like, fans. Also, the answer is no. No, you can't. You can't do that. <clears throat> <laughs> Hitting shy guy ass. Oh, yeah. True. You got me. <laughs> ba bomb. I don't I don't know if Ba Bomb was in the original game. Like I said, I didn't play this far. Oh, but I see I see the block. I might have made a mistake. An easily repaired mistake, but a mistake nonetheless. Hello, Zeal. How is the game? So far it seems good. There's a- I have a cut- there's like a couple nitpicks about stuff they changed. But overall pretty- pretty decent. Pretty good remake. Oh, you gotta trick them. You gotta trick them. Yeah, see, and now he's down here, where he did not want to be! And we all know that blue air is by far the stinkiest color of air. Oh, you were just supposed to do that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, okay. Hang on, hang on, we gotta do some more tricking. We gotta do some more gaslighting girl boss. That's because blue is the color of porta potty water and mini golf water. Because you know they put the they put the blue food coloring in there to make you think that the water isn't poo water, but it actually is. Oh, and then we got these things from all the most recent Mario games. Here we go. Oh, but now you gotta toggle. You gotta toggle them. Mario has been castrated. I probably should have done this first. Oh, 
No, I want I want the I want that. No way, I see what I gotta do. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot and a fool. In man's clothing. Then you gotta re-red. And there you go. Gets a little, you know, it gets a little crumbly. No, no. Okay, I'm fine. Uh, actually, I'm fine. Now we gotta visit Tweety. Here we go. Mamma mia. Well, that didn't go well. I thought maybe the bird would activate it for me. Uh, I'm a little confused. So I guess you want to like do... Oh, no, wait, 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 I'm, I'm a stoopy man. I'm a stoopy poopy man. Hello, gelatinous chunk. Good, u good username, by the way. So I, I think what I want to do is this. I do not remember the circus area at all from the original game. Not sure if I ever finished it. I never finished it either, but there's a reason you don't remember this. It's because this wasn't in the original game. This is a new area. Completely new content. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, I was forcibly birded. This is Sprito, by the way. Oh, hey, Sprito. Good thing you told me that, because I would have assumed you were some kind of new person I had never met before. That's the thing, that's the thing with talking to people on the internet is, you got names and maybe avatars. So if you change both of those, I have no idea it's you. I have no idea who you are. Yeah, please, please die. Thank you. Not you. Uh, I meant the bird. The bird needs to die. Door doesn't even open. It just, just get, he just walks through the keyhole. Oh, cannon. It is cannon that this is what I must deal with. The keyhole is the door. You know, I mean, I feel like that's a good idea at this point. Just cut out the middleman, you know? Oh crap. No, it. Just optimize the whole process. No, how do I get that? I want that. No, no, hang on. Hang on, little bud. Little bud man. Bud light. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. I think I gotta activate the blue. I think the blue is the key, because I think Mario's hitbox is big enough. 
to where he'll just be able to do that. Yeah, there, there we go. Okay. Yeah, Mario's got one of them big collectible hitboxes. I mean, like, four collectibles, not that you collect his hitbox. Though that, that, that that's a good business idea. Like, I have trading cards, and it's like, there's, there's not any characters on it. I'm just like, oh, hey, look, this one is the Piranha Plants hitbox from Mario 1. No one will buy it. Hitbox harvesting is illegal in 26 countries. Do not poach... Do not poach enemies for their hitboxes, please. Some of them are endangered. Some of them only appear in one level. Not including America. Yeah, because, I mean, why would we make something like that illegal? We just need to make it, like, illegal to... I don't know trans your gender or whatever. But that's getting a little political. My old college mate, Paul Lytical. <laughs> Again, apologies for the sniffling and the nasaliness. Like I said, I, I am sickly. Bro used his whole brain in 30 seconds for Paul Lytical. Uh, no, I was also playing a video game. I don't know if you noticed. <laughs> like, there's a little uh, red guy running around the screen. I'm controlling him at the same time. Like, I, I don't know if you know this. I, like... Yeah, some people... I was wondering if some people might have thought that, you know, I, I just put this up to keep people's attention. You know, like those TikTok videos. Now, come on, give it, give it, give me... Give me the juice. Can I stand on these? No, I cannot. Good to know. Good information for me to have. You need to have a Family Guy episode and someone cutting kinetic sand in the corner. You know, you know. We got... We got some space, we got some room. Hang on, let me, let me see. We got- we got some room in the corner here. Family Guy Funny Moments compilation. For... Ah, for 45 minutes. That'll work nicely. Yeah, here, here comes the bit. Here comes the bit. It's coming. Well, I have to wait a second for that to download, so... The bit, the bit will continue in a moment. Uh-oh! Don't fire a cannonball at me. The bit, it's coming. Coming this summer. From Martin Scorsese, The Bit.
I'm sure- I'm sure by the time that we get done with the boss, the bit will be ready. Oh, secret. This game has bosses? Yes! It does. And it will absolutely be worth the wait, yes. It won't at all be- be a waste of time. And our attention, and money. Yeah, the sax- the sax player needs a hefty raise. And then the computer they compose this on is like, thank you. No. I didn't know they just walk into it. It's the meme song. Yeah, it's that one that everybody know. Okay, now I need them- oh. I- I thought that would've killed them. I'm gonna be honest with you. I legitimately thought that might have killed them. Hmm, now how do I- I don't want them going off the ledge. And they didn't! Hooray for me! Hurry for me, Luigi! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Luigi probably not in this game. Poor dude, he has not been getting a lot of respect lately. Okay, here's the boss. Is that Martinet's voice for Mario? Uh, yes it is. This game originally had Martinet. So, it still uses Martinet. And yeah, I'm wondering, I'm wondering... How long it'll take for us to see the residual Martinet dry up. Donkey Kong. Now, see, what's funny, though, is that while they're using residual Martinet, they are not using residual Grant Kirkhope, which I think is interesting. They, they actually replaced DK's voice for this. So, I wonder why. I mean, they... I don't know what the deal is with, you know, Nintendo and Martinet. Like, I don't know if... I don't know if he quit, or if they told him to quit. Kirk Hope voiced DK in the original version of the game, if I recall right. So he was going like, Okay! Banana slammer. Banana slammer, bitch. Okay. The bit- the bit is ready, as predicted. And we're going to Spooky House. Oh, stop. Come back. Yo, I'm beginning to realize that maybe oh, having Family Guy yeah. funny moments oh, 45 God, minutes won't be good for my CPU. I'm so sorry. It's been like 500 years. <laughs> 
Ah, oh, this is your big moment and I'm ruining it. <sighs> Oh god, Stewie's Stewie's cutting something up. I don't know if I like that. Sorry, I forgot my jacket. Hopefully, hopefully you Twitch doesn't hate I want me for to that. Feel like a person for a second. Oh yeah, sure, no problem. All right, Quagmire, you do upper, I'll do lower. Sure, let's do it. <laughs> Is this legal? I don't know. Well, thanks, guys. Filter it a bit nicer. Guys, guys, put them back up. I just thought of something. Oh, hang on. Uh, I need to turn off the volume. We can't. We can't have the volume play. <laughs> Your Honor, it was just a bit. Oh, hey, it's Thwomp. It's the spooky ghost peeps. The spooky stone ghosts, apparently. Yeah, according to Mario World's manual, apparently Thwomps are a type of ghost. But honestly, oh wait, this is. That's a unique thwomp design. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's like it's like the toy thwomp. I get it. Oh, I love this song. Bow 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 bow. Bow 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 bow. Where's the present? I don't see it anywhere. Where is the present? Probably behind the thwomp. So I'm gonna have to get the thwomp down out of the zone, out of the zone. I would have hated this game as a kid. Yeah, it's meant for the, it's meant for big brain kids like myself. Okay, you gotta you gotta platform on the spikes. Oh, violin. I wonder if this is like real violin. That sounded pretty real. Maybe they just have really good VSTs. Uh oh. No, it's okay. God, there's a lot of like graphic stuff happening in the family guy in the family guy episode that I put in the corner. I mean, it's not an episode. It's a funny moments compilation. And I'm pretty sure that's Jesus. Here we go. No wait, I, I wanna I wanna get the thing. There we go. Oh, no, wait, 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 crap. No, wait, I think I gotta redo it. Dreep. There we go. And then it's Shieldman. I cannot pick him up, but he can push me. He does not hurt, he simply push. He is all defense, no offense. No offense meant. Dang it, Mario. Dang it, Mario. And yep, that is a that is a Dark Knight parody. Oh, shy guy block. 
I mean, it's better than minion block, at least. Is this a continuation of Donkey Kong 94 or something? Yeah. It's basically Donkey Kong 94... 94 2. And honestly, it's pretty good. I mean, I'd say I like Donkey Kong 94 better, but it's still it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh no! Oh no! My precious platform pulled. Oh. Oh. The fiddle. I bet you didn't know it, son, but I'm a fit. Wait, wait, where's the key? Oh, right, the key's down there. So I- wait, I actually did want to fall down there. What is going on in Family Guy? <laughs> I mean, just- just for full disclosure, I don't- I don't really watch Family Guy. It's not really my thing. So I have absolutely no context for anything that's happening. Especially with no sound. Oh wait, I gotta probably throw the key up. No? Oh no, wait, I see, I see, I see. Running low on time for this one. Hootie! The samples are so professionally produced for a DS OST. Well, this was Game Boy Advance originally. And, uh... Oh, that's the Shy Guy block. And in the original version of the game, it kind of sounded like Windows General MIDI. Which was pretty funny. It's a shame that a lot of my regulars are missing this because this is some good this is some good quality streaming right here. Yeah, see, in the original game, I'm pretty sure that fall would have put me out of commission. So they made it- they made it a little bit more forgiving. Oh god, the boo. You're annoying in regular Mario, too. This is the DK rep we waited 10 years for. Honestly, I'm- I'm still confident that something more substantially Donkey Kong is coming. Because, you know, they've- they've been pushing Donkey Kong a fair bit lately. I mean, heck, they're giving him his own wing of the theme park. So, I- I feel like they got something more planned for the old gorilla man. Me, 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 me. 
Booby, booby, booby. Stinky doo doo, caca pee pee, go down in the hole, don't you know now? It's Mario DK. <laughs> I swear, the freaking boo. That's what gets you. That's what gets you. No, 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 no. Get up out my butthole. I don't want boo to hang around me because he's no fun. I fell again. Oh, you gotta set the you gotta turn the blue back on last. Oh lad, you're not gonna get anywhere without the blue. Yahoo! Basically, do the whole level again, mate. <laughs> you missed the plot for me. <laughs> You know, I wonder... I feel like a couple of these are the same uh, voice clips they used in Mario Sunshine. I mean, not that one. Okay, this guy could probably crush you right here. Oh, oh. Huh. Huh. Some of them definitely come from Odyssey. Yeah, I'd believe it. Oh, you're supposed to ride the platform. I'm stupid. I'm a stupid man. No, I need you to push me this way. Yeah, I, I don't know. This might be a two-streamer, but if it's... <laughs> it might not be a long second stream. I, I think there's eight worlds, and we're already, like, towards the end of world six. I mean, world five. So, yeah, this is not... this is not gonna be a long playthrough. The streamer part of me is saying good, because that means I can get on to other stuff quicker. But then, the person of me, the side of me that paid $50 for this kind of wishes there was more game. But then again, I mean, you paid, you paid 30 for this on the game, why did I do that? You paid 30 for this on the Game Boy Advance back in the day. Very unique thwomp sound effects. Still think they should have added a level editor. I mean, it would have been cool. Because, you know, the original game was indeed supposed to have one. And it was supposed to, like, connect with the GameCube. Somehow. I don't know how they were planning that to work. I mean, I mean, obviously with the link cable, but... And the DS did have one. Yeah. It's just kind of a shame because that's the one I didn't want to <laughs> make levels in. And didn't need to make levels in because they just kept making them. They just kept making them again and again and again. Like I said, just flood the market. Flood the market. Release schedule looking a little light. Just throw Mario vs. Donkey Kong in there. It'll be... Fine. Oh. Uh, 
I need to move that some more. Yeah, the DK fans will love it. <laughs> I mean, look. Let's... Let's be fair. It, let's be fair. These cost like zero dollars to make. <laughs> and they they were not replacing uh, a Donkey Kong Country game. Let's... Let's not get angry about like, oh, they're... Why am I so stupid? Let's get angry about that instead. <laughs> but yeah, they're, they're not... They were not replacing a DK game, it's just... When Nintendo di had nothing else to release, when they had nothing else... ...and they wanted to pad out the Wii U's release schedule... ...they would turn to Mario vs. DK. It's just... it's that simple. They canceled Metroid Prime 4 for this. Honestly, we still don't have any evidence that Metroid Prime 4 is actually a game they started developing. We still have no evidence that that is a real game. They delayed Silk Song for this. I mean, honestly, if Team Cherry got to work on a Mario game, I'd be I'd be happy for him. That would be- that would be pretty cool. It, it'd probably be like the most gorgeous Mario game, too. You know what? You know what, let- let Team Cherry make a Wario Land. Let- let somebody make a Wario Land, please! Dark Souls 2D Mario. No, no, see, I'm the one who's making that. <laughs> they might fit better for Zelda. Ooh, ooh, let Team Cherry make Zelda 2. 2. Oh yeah, just spawn me right next to the... Right next to the thwomp. The thwimp. I wish people would make more games like this, like... 2D... I love 2.5D stuff. I wish people besides Nintendo would make it. That being said, I still need to pick up that, uh, Prince of Persia game. I just haven't had a lot of money. I do want to get it. Because it, it, it honestly looks really cool. New Wario game with the gloomy aesthetic of Hollow Knight, but Wario is normal. What am I doing? <laughs> I, I want that present. Okay, no, it needs to be red. Honestly, I think part of the thing that makes Wario really funny is when he's in, like, out-of-place scenarios. Oh, it has to be red, but I have to get up there while it's red. Hmm, can I do this? Oh, yeah, I totally can. It's not even a problem, really. Oh, 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 oh. The Mario dance. Do the Mario! Do the not getting on the platform, even though I swear I was on the platform. The OST is quietly banging. Yeah, that's honestly probably the best way to describe it. It's it's banging, but it's not in your face about being banging. It's going to be a little reserved about it. Okay, you just gotta... <laughs> oh, 
Oh god. That I need to put that in the quotes channel. That's a that's, that's one of my favorite chat messages. Ah, oh, I got tread marks on my head. Head marks, if you will. But yeah, I just I just really want a new Wario Land game. I mean, Pizza Tower and Anton Blast are cool, but you know, it's never a replacement for the man himself. You know what I mean? You feel me? You feel me on that one? Stop feeling me. I didn't give you permission. <laughs> but yeah, we're we're <laughs> We are closer to the end than I would like to admit. Here we go. Honestly, I I almost feel like Pizza Tower. Okay, so I often complain about like, the spiritual successor indie games not having enough of their identity. Enough of their own identity, I mean. But I feel like Pizza Tower kind of got its own thing going on by really honing in on the speed game aspect of it. Like, Pizza Tower was like, what if Wario Land 4 was fast as shit? That's, that's what Pizza Tower is. But as a result, it ends up not quite feeling... It, it, it doesn't quite scratch the same itch anymore. Which is kind of the... It's kind of the peril of that whole thing. Oh wait, can I, I can just stand on their heads. I feel like Anton is probably going to be a bit more Wario-esque, even though... The creator is insisting, no, no, dude, it's actually Crash Bandicoot, don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, nope, messed it up. It could be multiple things. True. True. T Pizza Tower's taking the basic ideas of Wario Land and going a different direction with it. That's true, yeah. That's about- that's about how I'd describe it. It, it gets the same base, but it doesn't quite follow up on it in the same way. I am trying to get rid of the swamp. I, maybe I just need to like do that and then like lead them under real fat. Yeah, you just I was overthinking it. I was overthinking it. I'm sorry. I need you to go off the edge actually. I need you to I need you to collect the why. Don't ask me why. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I know what I gotta do. Okay, come here. Okay. Okay. Aha! You see? You see what you've done? But then how do I- how do I get them over there? How do, how do I get them over there? They can't jump, can they? Oh, I guess they can. They can, in fact, jump. Oh, <laughs> 
Uh oh, they're sign waving. Oh, oh, no, wait, crap. That's what they mean by not getting hit. Like, each mini Mario equals one hit for the DK fight. But if you want the star, you gotta not get hit. No, no, I, I want to do a no-hit run of this. Because you get probably a bonus of some sort. It makes him corporeal. Uh, okay, getting, getting hit while holding the thing doesn't count. That's what I need to remember. Dang, this- this one's a little tough. Oh, no, 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 no. This one's a little on the tough side. Because, yeah, DK doesn't give you a ton of time to do this. God, that one, that one was my own hubris. I got a little too confident. What's your bit rate to put out 60 FPS? I, I normally stick around 5,000 uh, kilobits per second, unless the game is like Sonic or F-Zero, in which case I bump it up to 6,000. Why, is it looking stinky? Oh my god. It looks great. I just wanted to know if I start streaming. Yeah, it's... Admittedly, it's kind of a lot to do. I, I don't... I don't know. Like, you gotta make sure your network and computer can both handle it. Because I... Like, my old laptop absolutely could not stream at this bitrate. So a lot of my older streams look worse than this. Oh, 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 no! I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Pete? That's assuming Twitch doesn't decide to fuck you over your itself. Yeah, that's true. Sometimes Twitch can just be rude. Lower bit rate is more stable, but it's gonna look like a little poopier. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. DK is not happy. Not happy at all. Slippery Summit. I'm a little scared of the Family Guy clip. I'm gonna be honest with you. Okay, good. We did not see Peter's Peter. Slip. This is some really icy looking ice. Oh god, it's Sonic Lost World. Uh-oh. Okay, look, give me that. And you need the red to stop it. Oh! Be careful there, Martini. Oh. Ha! <laughs> 
Oh, the shy guy's having a hard time getting traction. It would be kind of adorable if he wasn't trying to kill me. Oh, oh, yeah, see, I see, I see what's going on here. The no traction world. All the ninjas are back, and also Brick. Here we go. Oh, it's so, so tranquil, so serene. And then you got Sproing Dot Wave. Oh. This music feels like DK is going to learn something about himself today. The truth is, Mario, I never wanted the toys. I just wanted my dad to be proud of me. Cranky never appreciated anything I ever did. And it gets to be a lot, you know. Wow, DK, I... I never knew this about you before. <laughs> and I say this while Family Guy is playing down there. <laughs> That's- that's just what happened in the Mario movie. No, not exactly. <laughs> they were- they were a bit less compassionate. <laughs> oh. Okay, yeah, you gotta make the blue. You gotta make the blue happen. Why am I so bad at video games? See, this is- this is exactly why I took the master out of my name. Because I ain't a master in nothing. Can I throw this on top of you? No, I can't. But can you bounce on it? No, you can't. You cannot do any of these things I have just described. But yeah, it, it's just it's just weird for like a, a Donkey Kong game. Well, not a Donkey Kong game. That Donkey Kong Country would make a lot of sense. But, like, to Donkey Kong arcade-style game to have music that tranquil and emotional. <laughs> the blue fire. You know, that burns the hottest. And see, this plays in the scene where Donkey Kong is cheering up again, and he's like, Mario, I- I know what I have to do. I have to help you on this adventure.
I realize now that my father's approval was never important. It, I had to be true to myself. Where's that last present? Oh, it's up there. Crap. There we go. And now here's the fireman. He was advertised. He was foretold in the ancient texts. That is a solid block up there. Oh, no, wait, I see what's going on. I see. I see. I see. Get it? Do you, do you see what I did there? It's pretty funny. Okay, so I think because my butt's starting to get sore. I think that's where I'll probably end it this time. And we'll we'll do a second stream of this where we finish it up. Probably. And if it runs a little short, I can always just throw in Spelunky or something. You know how that goes. But anyway, thank you for tuning in. Had a good time. Hope you did as well. Next time will probably be more Spyro. Finish Spyro up. I don't know. Maybe it'll be this. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what happens.